Hello everyone, welcome back to the legend. We are here for another juicy, juicy reaction video. I have only made, this is only my second time making one of these, okay? It, 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 please, just don't judge me too hard. Don't, don't blame me too hard if I'm like super awkward. I'm usually at the top like right or top left of the corner in a much smaller space. So I'm not as distracting on the screen. Cause I can, I can see myself right now, it's just distracting. I, I'm so, don't judge me, okay? I'm, I usually have a gameplay to help focus my thoughts. But I'm trying my best. Uh, hopefully I'll get more used to it. And this one's really special because the first time was uh, looking at the Resident Evil 8 trailer. And I had actually already watched that trailer uh, when I reacted to it. I, I wanted to react to it to get, just to get my thoughts. But I understand the concept that like it's not very interesting to watch someone react to something that they've already seen. But this time's different, lads. We are reacting to the very first ever, I think... I, this is the first I've ever seen. So as far as I know, like, this th this is the first gameplay ever put out for Resident Evil 8, okay? And it's gonna, it's gonna show actual gameplay, it's gonna show actual, like, using the guns, using, like, going around a place. I, I, I think it's, like, an actual portion of the game that you go through, and they, and they, I don't know, that you, you... I don't know, you fight some creatures? I haven't actually seen this one. So this is going to be really interesting. I'm so freaking excited about Resident Evil 8. I, we're literally only a month. Oh my god, only a month. <laughs> a little over a month. I think it's May 7th is when it comes out. And today is like April 3rd or something like that. So anyway, let's get into it. Let's just let's just watch this. Oh, courtesy of IG. Oh my god. Oh, mommy. <laughs> mommy. <laughs> Lady Demetrescu. <laughs> Mommy milkies. Oh my god. Oh, where are you going? Mommy, where are you going? Please step on me. Uh, step on me. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we're we're into the old uh, vampire's mansion here. Um we got that knife. Whoa. Oh, they're skipping. They're skipping some places here. They're skipping forward, making sure they don't show you too much, I guess. This is also taken from the PS4 Pro. This is not PS5 footage. This is PS4 Pro. I don't have a PS4 Pro, but I do have. I, I've obviously have a PS4. There really isn't that much of a difference, or so I've been led to believe. Like the graphically, I'm pretty sure there's not that much of a difference visually between like a regular PS4 and a PS4 Pro. Like there's really not. It, it, there's not that big of a difference. So basically, what I'm taking that at as is what I'm seeing in front of me right here is basically what the game's gonna look like for me. Uh, at least it better be. Ooh, little pistola. Everything's looking like really Resident Evil 7 -y. Like I, I like that, obviously. Bye, have a great day. Whoa, whoa, what the hell are these things? Dude. Where did he go? What did he just slip into the fucking Twilight Zone? was it was it that one like meme? I don't know what that was it like a Mario game or something? Where like f dropped and then like oh they they go underwater and they and they just pop up from the water, I see. Okay. They're just gonna be jump scaring us down here, I guess. Oh my gosh, th this looks pretty clean. Like, I like it. All the blood stained water. Oh my goodness. Oh, the. Oh shit. Dude, what are these things? There's some kind of ghouls. Ghoulies. Some witches. They kind of look like blood. One of those bloodborne creatures. You know those creatures, uh. Uh, that like grab you and like and like suck out your soul or something in Bloodborne. What the hell is? Oh, that's the currency. Five hundred thirty lel. This boy, this man has a shotgun, right? Like just waiting for someone to pop up. Just waiting for a head. Look, an enemy has a sword. What the hell? Just waiting to blow off some freaking heads, man. Oh my goodness, this game looks so good, lads. Oh. Oh. The fuck? They just come. They just randomly come out of the water at times. It's gonna be so fucking terrifying. I hope that maybe they like actually change some of these spawns. I kind of doubt it. They're probably, but I mean, some like a whole month's gonna go by, so I'm not gonna remember everything in this video. So it'd be fine. I would like if they like changed the spawns of these things so that people can't like. No, holy Jesus Christ! The jump scares, dude. They're like some kind of ghoulish looking people down here. I don't know. I mean, we got vampires, we got werewolves in this. I like that that switching weapons. It looks a lot more smoother. 
the I, I like the how the guns sound. I like how the they look. They they feel a little bit more realistic than the Resident Evil Seven stuff felt. Um, they sound a little bit better. It's just kind of quiet. Um, I might actually. I don't know if I can do it right now though. Um, ah, I think I think it's okay. It's probably okay. Probably hear it fine. Maybe I don't know. Uh. Okay, so we're at. Ooh, ring, ring, ring! Zoe, no, <laughs> Zoe, is that you? No. Um, but we get apparently we still have phones. Oh, oh no! This is the cutscene for. Oh. oh my God, mommy, mommy! Oh my goodness! I I won't ever run from you. I don't care how many times I die. I don't care how many. I don't care how many times you kill me. I'm done. I'm gonna give I'm gonna give her a minimum of like 20 times and then and then I'll run away. Uh, uh, but I, I just I regret to inform you. Oh my god, I can't I can't run away from my mommy. Escaped the fool Heisenberg. Heisenberg, okay. Because he is in my castle and has already proven too much for my daughters to handle. When I find him. Okay. Oh, so that's it. So we're pretty much at the end here. Yes, of course. I understand the importance of the ceremony. I won't let you down. Okay, so it's gonna end with this cutscene. We already kind of. <laughs> oh my god, she just freaking just hurled that mirror, dude. Like, holy crap, she just picked up the. <laughs> Like oh my god, Jesus Christ! If if she hold if she held my head in those hands, those massive mommy milky hands, dude. Oh my, I would be absolutely like my cranium would just cave into a black hole. Like those massive, just mass massively strong arms, dude. Oh my goodness, dude. Like, I, I I I have to tell you, man. Like. As, as much as I want to be held by Mommy Milkies, okay, I, as soon as she would grab me, I would literally snap in half. Like, oh my god. Dude, that was awesome. It was a very little tiny snippet of gameplay, you know, in, in some of the other cutscenes. But the biggest thing that it showed me is that it looks and feels like Resident Evil 7, but better. Like, it looks cleaner. It looks crispier and the more delicious like just clean but at the same time not clean because there's blood everywhere but clean oh my good I, oh my god i'm so like that's only like that gameplay i i would imagine it's only just the beginning because that they they obviously only shown things that you know that we've already seen in resident evil 7 like we saw the knife the pistol and a shotgun which is nothing new we like there's definitely other like guns that we've never seen before i wouldn't be surprised if there was like a crossbow or something in this game because like werewolves or vampires or something i wouldn't be surprised if there was some kind of like i don't know maybe even like holy water or something i, I <laughs> maybe even like throwing holy water and shit at people or something. i don't know man but uh that maybe another maybe a flamethrower again i don't know but there's definitely other types of guns obviously they're they're bringing some stuff from like like Resident Evil 4 into this with like with the currency and the fact that like there's a buyer there's that like big fat guy if you saw that demo a while back that you can buy things from and you have that kind of inventory where, where you have to like manage like kind of Resident Evil 4 style I think they're, they're bringing back which is so cool yeah it looks fantastic like I'm so freaking excited dude like I I I'm going to go so fucking ham into this game when it comes up. this first person Resident Evil man like I I'm so I'm so glad that it's freaking back. Like, I, I, th like not to say anything bad. Seriously, not to say anything bad about the third-person Resident Evils. I just prefer the first-person experience of Resident Evil because I just think it's so much more in like such an intimate horror, a visceral like you feel like you're there and the st and, uh, like horrifying events are happening to you instead of you just watching horrifying events happen to someone else on screen. 
uh, because you're in their shoes in the first person perspective, it actually feels like it's happening to you. Like when those jump scares, it, for instance, if I was a, a, in a third person perspective, like Leon or something, and that popped up, yeah, I would get jump scared, but it wouldn't be as scary because I'd be like, oh, oh, should Leon know, you know, something like that, you know, because I'd be seeing it happen to someone else. But in game, I, I felt a fear. There, like while watching this I felt that like just a little bit of a tinge just a little bit of a tinge of the fear uh, that I remember feeling in Resident Evil 7 when something jumped out at me in that first person view because it felt like it was happening at me and I was it's a lot more scary for me that thing just popping out of the water when you're in first person perspective uh, rather than third person it's just like I, I love that stuff the campiness the, the kind of like enemies around every corner like having to uh, navigate around enemies in the third person is just so cool because you actually feel like you're there and you actually feel like you and like with those enemies are playing a kind of cat and mouse I can't wait to to be able to do some of that I really hope that we have that with the like vampire sisters where you have to play this kind of cat and mouse like like hiding while they're going around I can I can assure you that that's that's definitely going to happen in the game and oh my god I, I miss that so much I miss that from Resident Evil 7 so much. I God, I cannot fucking wait for this game. But anyway, uh, I, I could freaking gush about this for forever, but I, I don't want this to be too long. So like if you enjoyed this. Subscribe if you want to see more content on my channel. As always, hope you guys have an awesome green day. And uh, I'll see, see you in a month. Oh, God, God, this is going to be the longest month ever. Come on, please. I need it. Can you come to me. Come to Poppy. I need you. I, I need you. Please, Mommy Milky. Come <laughs> step on me. Oh, my God. Those hands, those fucking gorilla hands, fucking that gorilla strength, dude, that monkey, monkey strength that she did there, oh my goodness, Jesus Christ, she's gonna be so freaking awesome, dude, she's gonna be so hype and so hilarious in this game, like, she's gonna be so terrifying, but also at the same time, just this hilarious and, and, like, hype, all all at once all mixed together at all times whenever she's on screen it's it's gonna be so good it's gonna be so fun i can't wait for markiplier to literally drool like drool onto his freaking pc like like every time she comes on it's gonna be funny but anyway as i ramble and ramble on here i'll see you guys next time bye